What's going on? I'm back. It's such a nice day again. No more oppressive heat. It's time to kick back and have a soda. <clears throat> Today we're trying a uh, new grape. It's a grape soda. I don't think there's going to be a lot of challenging information there. The, the thing I learned the most that I thought was cool about New Grape when I read their history before the video is that it seems like they've just been owned and made by everybody over the years. Like, uh, all these little independent soda companies keep closing and getting bought out by bigger companies. And it's like this was uh, originally made, I think, in Tennessee. But then it moved to Louisiana for a long time as its own company. Then it got bought out by Big Red, and they made it in Texas for a long time. Now it's been bought out by Ale 8, and they make it in the South somewhere again. And I, it's crazy. Like a new grape, I've seen it everywhere. This has always been like uh, a standard sort of off-brand type soda to me. I used to think it was like a budgety type thing, not a weird one. I thought it was like, like a no-name. I always sort of think that with fruit flavored sodas. I always think they're generics. It's good, it's good soda. It's real grapey. Drinking it some more out of my Club Med Paradise Island glass. Ooh. I think it's like an 80s daiquiri glass. I ain't ever really been to Club Med, I'm not gonna lie to you. It's real good, it's good soda. I don't know, at this point, it's getting hard to find new things to say about kinds of orange soda and grape soda. They're all just sort of the super sweet grape flavoring, like almost like a Kool-Aid flavor. This one though, more like along the lines of the grape popsicle, super sugary and easy going, not, a, not the heavy carbonation. It's not gonna hurt or burn, it's just, Real sweet and easy going. New Grape is a good time. Like I said, I always like trying the regional ones, so it interests me very much. Thank you so much for watching. Like and subscribe to the videos. Share them with your friends. Don't forget to visit andycooksfood.com.